Hi, this is Munson from Munson Music, and we're going to talk about how you can play a lot of different songs really, really quick. So we're going to start on a G major chord. The way you play G major, first finger is going to go in the A string on the second fret, second finger is going to go in the low E string on the third fret, and the third finger is going to go to high E on the third fret. And if you strum all of those together, then that's called a G major chord, and it sounds really, really happy. And actually, there are a couple chords that are a couple songs that we could play with just that one chord. So if you just did a lot of downs on that chord, then we could do the Frerachaka, Or you might be more of a fan of Row, Row, Row Your Boat. Row, Row, Row Your Boat. Gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 merrily. Life is but a dream. But, but then from there, let, let, let's go ahead and go over another chord. And one of my other favorite chords of all time is D major. And the way you play D major, first finger is going to go G string on the second fret. Second finger is going to go to the high E on the second fret. Third finger is going to go to the B string on the third fret. And if you strum just the top four strings, just D, G, B, and E, you'll get your clear sound out of that. And that's called D major. And it sounds really, really happy. And just to get another chord going on, uh, let, let's try C major. The way you play C major, first finger is going to go to the B string on the first fret. Second finger is going to go D string on the second fret. Third finger is going to go A string on the third fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds a C major chord. It sounds really, 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 really happy. So there are a lot of songs that we could work some, some blocking with that. And actually, what, one, one really good one w w would be a Wild Thing. Like if you know Wild Thing, you can do G major with kind of a down, 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 and then a C with a down, down. Actually, walking on sunshine, you could do that, that same thing. But we have uh, G, C, D, C, G, C, D, C. And then when you get to your chorus on that, there's just a lot of that D, O, C. I'm walking on D. of traditional songs that we could kind of do with, with that same kind of thing. Um, like one would be I'll Fly Away, if you know that song. Some bright morning when this life is over, see I'll fly G way to a place on God's celestial shore. I'll be fly G way. Or if you know You Are My Sunshine, that's another good one. See, you are my sunshine. Shine, G, my only sunshine. You make me see happy. G, when skies are gray. You'll never see no dear. How much I, G, love you. Please don't, G, take my D sunshine a G way. Or if you know, uh, will the circle be unbroken? That's another good one. Will the circle be unbroken? I see by Lord, by G, by. There's a better home awaiting in the G sky, Lord, the in the sky. Or Amazing Grace is another good traditional one. Amazing G Grace, see how sweet the G sound, the G saved, the G rich like D me. My favorites actually is is happy birthday to D U, happy D birthday to G U, happy G birthday dear C whoever you are, happy D birthday to G U. Or another really good chord song I actually um what would be free falling if you know free falling it'd be kind of a G chord C chord C G. You know, uh, let's see, the sweater song by Weezer actually is kind of that same chord progression. We're going G, C, D, C, G. If you see one, two, D, destroy my C sweater, O, G, O. Pull the C thread as I D walk a C way. So that could be 
a good one too. Um, a lot of times with the, with a lot of these songs, though, to make them more interesting, I like adding what I call a strum pattern to them. And one of my favorite strum patterns for a four four is down, down, up, up, down, up. So if you took the G chord, so we can kind of add this to some of these songs and make them a little bit more interesting. We could just try that a lot, just doing the down, 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 down up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. So another good song that, that you may want to try is Clocks by Coldplay, and you could start that on the D chord doing that strum pattern, and then go to a C chord. Fleetwood Mac, actually, you could do that with a C chord and a D chord with that same strum pattern. C, D, down, up, up, down, C, down, down, up, up, down, D, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down, D, down, down, up, up, down, up. Or you could do a Sweet Home Alabama, actually, with a very similar chord pattern where you go to D, down, up, Sweet Child of Mine by Guns N' Roses, where we have D, that D, that is D, C, D, C, reminds me of childhood, C, memories, with G, every day was this G, down, down, up, up, down, D, down, down, up, up, down, D, down, down, up, up, down, up. Or we could kind of do the beginning of Every Rose Has a Storm by, by Poison, we could do the G chord, down, up, do like Ring of Fire by Johnny Cash. We do the G, G down, up, up, down, G down, down, up, up, down. And we get to our chorus. We got the D, I, F, L, D, N, to C, burning, ring of D, fire. And when the red solo G come down, up, up, down, G, I, fill you, G, up. Let's have a C party. Twist and shout. Be down, down, see down, down, be down, down. Shake it up, see baby, now see, shake it up, be baby. Twist and be da, see da da di da, da 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 di da, da 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 see da da di down, down, up, up, down. She people say, see, we got di da.
So uh, it, a, another chord that kind of happens a lot is an E minor chord, and, and it's a really sad chord, but it's one of my favorite chords. You do one on the A string on the second fret, second finger goes D on the second fret, and if you strum all those together, that sounds an E minor chord, and it sounds really, really sad.